Now, Ontario Provincial Police have announced hundreds of charges laid as a part of massive province-wide se child sexual abuse investigation. In October 2022, our provincial strategy policing agencies have identified 61 victims, conducted 255 investigations, executed 168 warrants, and seized 1,032 electronic devices. We've arrested 107 people and laid 428 charges. We also safeguarded 60 children. The province-wide investigation involved 27 different police agencies, 175 investigations, and still ongoing and may result in additional charges. For more on this, let's bring in CDB's Austin Delaney. Uh, Austin, what did the police have to say about this in greater detail? This is a massive exercise they undertook with several departments working to come to these results. Uh, Austin, we'll have to try and fix the audio with you in just a moment. I think... Okay. Hold the stick. Okay, let's try and Hello? do that again, Austin. I think we can hear so, you now. Yes. Okay, we'll do it again. Good. Uh, it involved 27 police departments from across Ontario, including the Solicitor General's Department and the Attorney General's. It was a month-long blitz in October to online child exploitation. And you heard those numbers. They're staggering. I'm going to read a couple of them again. 61 victims, uh, 107 arrests, 428 charges, and more than a thousand electronic devices were seized with what I'm told are absolutely horrible images of young children uh, and child pornographic uh, images. So, and most of those, the bulk of these are here in Toronto. That's where the most of the charges were, most of the arrests. Right. What did the police say about uh, ways to combat child exploitation online? Well, they say you have to be careful with your own children that, uh, that they're, they're not sexting other people. And if you know somebody who's involved in this, you have to go to police. If you are involved in it, there's a good program, I'm told, at CAMH that you can get some help with that. And we do understand that this is an ongoing process and there are many more investigations underway at the moment, Austin. Yes, it's an ongoing process, and you, you just heard those numbers. I mean, this was a blitz, but they say they catch people all the time. There was one case they talked about here in Toronto. Toronto police were uh, fishing on the, on the dark web, and they found a person that was planning to kidnap and exploit the children he kidnapped. Uh, they found him in a small town in northern Ontario, and they arrested him. CDB's Austin Delaney, appreciate the update. Thank you. All right.